Aaron here with TNR Tape to talk about cloth numbers and their usability with TNR Tape. T cloth numbers are becoming really popular in a lot of series for a lot of reasons. They're reusable, they're flexible, they're much more or less likely to tear. Unfortunately, they've presented a little bit of challenge with TNR Tape in the past, specifically the champion system numbers. I think we have a solution in place, certainly not perfect, but it does extend the usability of TNR Tape to them. So with cloth numbers like this champion systems number, what you want to do is apply the TNR tape to the back of the number at minimum three hours and much preferably overnight. So basically when you go to pick up your race number at race registration the night before, apply the TNR tape right then or when you get back to your room or hotel. Then allow, it basically lets it tack up in advance and then before your race, uh, 45 minutes, an hour, whenever you would like to apply your number, then peel off the backer and stick it on you. What this does is it gives a little bit of initial time for the TNR tape to get a good bond to the number well in advance of applying it to the fabric that you'll be using like a skin suit or jersey. Um, we don't have a ton of data on the low end of that, like how soon can you apply it? Conservatively, two to three hours seems about like a good number. We may get more data and update that as it comes in, but right now it's about two to three hours. So basically, if you're within a window that's less than that, so let's say you show up to the race in 45 minutes or an hour is about the minimum that you could have applied to the number before you apply to your jersey, you're gonna risk maybe some adhesive transfer, especially with the champion systems number. So in that instance, maybe you have to use safety pins. Maybe it won't work in this application. But if you pick it up the night before, or you're gonna reuse the number a lot of times, stick it on the night before, and then you can reuse the number, peel it off, apply new TNR tape, and you can keep reusing it that way. The other thing that we're seeing a lot more of is stretchy numbers. So this is an example from Castelli. We can see that it's stretchy in one direction, but not stretchy in the other direction. So with these type of numbers, it's another little bit of a challenge. We don't quite have the same adhesion issue, but we're still gonna recommend that you apply the TNR tape in an overnight situation or minimum three hours before time. So again, take the TNR tape, apply it to the number, wait three hours, then peel it off and stick it on you. When it comes about is when you peel them off. So in this case, this is from the Mount Bora Epic, another stretchy number. It's stretchy in this direction, but not very stretchy in this direction. So when you're peeling it off, peel it off in the direction of the least stretchiness. So in this case, you can see that I'm peeling in the same direction that is not stretchy. And what this prevents is that the fabric stretches and tears the adhesive, and that can cause adhesive transfer too. So you can see that's, that one came off easy. Again, it's a t-shirt, so it's not a perfect example. But that's how we deal with stretchy numbers. So apply it minimum three hours. We'll be updating that as we have more data, preferably overnight before applying it to your jersey. And during peel off with stretchy numbers is peel off in the least stretchy direction, stretchy direction, do not peel off in the stretchy direction. So again, peel off in the non-stretchy direction. Again, thanks a lot for listening, checking us out here at TNR Tape. Hope to catch you around.